In this morning's health check, Arkansas's first HeartMate 3 was implanted this morning at Baptist Health Medical Center. The hospital's transplant institute is currently one of several dozen select centers chosen to evaluate and participate in this clinical trial. Channel 7's Maureen Glisevic brings us this story. My husband come down here around three weeks ago and he was a very, very sick man. Gina Henson's husband, Gary, suffers from coronary artery disease and was given just six months to live. But one of the options left was to enter a clinical trial at Baptist Health Medical Center. They had to run a lot of tests on my husband to make sure that he would qualify for any of the things that they could do for him. Baptist Health Transplant Institute is just one of 60 select centers chosen to test the HeartMate 3. And on Thursday morning, Gary became the first patient to undergo this surgery in the state while his family patiently awaited. This is the third generation of the HeartMate. Wow. It's been in development for like 17 years. The first generation we used in, in 1999, the second generation of HeartMate 2, we started using in 2008. Okay, are y'all ready to go back? Yes. yes. Go back and see? Yes. Him? After several hours of surgery, Gina and her daughters were able to see Gary. Shortly after, they could not thank Dr. Ransom enough. We think it'll be better. We think it'll have less problems with blood clots and hopefully less problems with bleeding for our patients. You know, I want him to slow down and, and let's enjoy life a little more, but knowing my husband, if he feels as well as they're saying, we have a farm and we are in partnership with his brother, I look for him to be back on the farm. Maureen Glisevic, Channel 7 News. And Dr. Ransom expects Gary to be released from the hospital within 10 to 14 days. Some good news there.